but I'm only human. I'm only human. I'm only human. I'm only. I'm only infinite. I'm only connected to a collective consciousness of an entire species who thrives to exist. I'm only a single part of a whole. I'm only a single universe of atoms. I'm only DNA directly affected, culminating to the current vibration combination of chromosomes, testosterone, estrogen, H2O, and more. I'm only human. Having this consciousness as large as my imagination, able to create illusions. As real as blueprints to buildings until manifested as constructed concepts become tangible, my my imagination is impossibly perfect. Designed to envision, I have visions that can give me stress or give me alternate scenarios to test while calling my body to react. Like imagining drowning could make me <gasps> short of breath while the image of myself in bed with a love that has the self-confidence of a lion with the heart of a penguin could make my heart skip a beat. Along over a decade, I'm only human. With this capacity to love, that makes each breath I take feel like it matters, and to make matters worse, it makes it feel like I matter to someone else. With the wealth inside that feels like diamonds dyed, compared to this feeling of bliss from a kiss that was free to give, to receive honestly, human. From Pangea to now, we are and have always been one. With determination, discipline, and infinite gifts to confront our grief. Suffering and ignorance to completely face the worst in ourselves throughout our history and still see through any misery beyond bending reality, confidently connecting new synapses and new habits to progress and change the process, then remain together to keep going on as lovingly as possible through ever all previous obstacles. It seems like being human is the best thing we could ever say. We are. Thanks again for that, y'all. Thanks again for listening.